What's up guys? Welcome back to JB's Toy Trunk for our this week's hunt video. You know that one commercial or show or preview, I don't know where I've seen it, but I think it's dealing with like the M&Ms. And they say they do exist. Well, we get to some targets this week and we actually see something that does exist. So watch the hunts and don't forget to stick around for the haul. We'll see you guys soon. So it's the first time seeing this guy, Rob Van Dam. You see Mysterio, or RVD. Check that out. And I think we've seen Booker. Can't really remember. We still got some Macho. Got my man Rikishi. There's the Jake Snake. First time seeing Jake. And we've got Elton John in the back, so I gotta just keep on speaking. So we've seen them all. Uh, Bam Bam. It's our last guy. But there's uh, Jake the Snake. A lot of rocks. Rock Quarry down there. Macho. I gotta pick him up eventually. Not today, though. Been spending a lot of money. Trying to take it easy. What we got over here? Takers, Mysterios, Rocks. There's another Dusty. Got to pick him up too. Go that mean Jim. Jake, Jake, three Jakes. Let's see what else they got, guys. I think we got a lot of the same stuff, guys. So it'll be real quick. Try to be real quick. Some Pokemon backpack. A little Mew, Mewtwo. Let's see. Warrior, older AEW, Biggie, got some WWE superstars, got your Cody. Someone was working with their three tier riser, very good. Uh, I use foam for mine, the old spirit, old foam board. I'm actually finishing up one right now. I'll show you guys when I'm done. But let's walk down this way. Super Mario. Seen some other Super Mario Brothers at other stores. Don't see the new movie set down here, but it's all right. Let's see. Oh, got our big turtles. Uh, shout out to Ryan. He let me know that we had two more Mikes. Michelangelo's here. And I'm good to go. Some more turtles. Jurassic Park. I finally seen that um, Jurassic World. Not bad. Definitely glad I waited for um, the... <laughs> For it to come to TV, how do you say? Streaming. Old Marvel, Jimmy Woo. Still gotta get my Jimmy Woo. Avatar, old statues, some buzz, D and D, Dungeons and Dragons. Got the vampire bat. Some old armored bat, and then there's the uh, the blue variant. Which at one time was the hardest to find. I don't want clearance. I remember I was getting register locked at a Target with that guy. There's another vampire bat. I love this guy. Let's see. Old uh, Soul Crusher. Got him. Let's see if there's anything else done. And Star Wars. Same thing. God, Beast Boy. Got three of them. I know a lot of you guys are looking for Beast Boy. How about that? Beast Boy in the morning. Like it. Pretty cool. What do you guys think? Definitely a pass for me. I don't need them, but how about that? First thing, Tuesday morning. Well, we haven't filmed in the collectibles area in a while, just because they really haven't had anything. But so let's see if there's anything new and different here. Okay, there's Arthur from Moon Knight. First time seeing this guy. There's Lucky, which is an older one. Zorro. Zorro has some stuff on him. 
put them back. Wash my hands. <laughs> oh, well, Hello Kitty and friends. Uh, Hello Kitty cinnamon roll. Pachaco, pachuco. <laughs> my melody and Kuromi, pachuco. I bet. Uh, there's a mic down there. Some more Zorro. Let's see, we get some uh, Texas Chainsaw. Texas Chainsaw Hatchet. Some Ghostface Medusa. Let's see what else we got going Toxie. Older. Oh, we got some. I meant older TMNT. We're still, I still haven't seen the new TMNT uh, Secret of the Ooze. T2. There's the Bride. Van Helsing. Frankenrath and, and the Mummy. We got your Karomi. Cinnamon roll, Hello Kitty, there's your Pachuco right there. What's up guys? Welcome back to JB's Toy Trunk. It is a wacky Wednesday and we are in West Ashley. If you could see behind that tree, that's right everybody, it's a Target. Looking for a spot, we are going to jump in there and see if Holothon actually exists or if it's completely fake. Is that a grail? Oh yeah, look at that. Leave it in the comments. I don't know, but we're actually watching this. I never thought we would watch this. Little Ellie, she's BA. She's, yeah, I want her on my team. Hey, that's not Pedro. No, that's not Ellie either. <laughs> but if we get that, and change the head sculpt. It's the video game. No, we could do that and change the head sculpt and yeah. put him on the horseback with Grogu. Just like that meme. Hey, now. Uh, no holothon, but some great NECA figures. New pops. Nothing down here. Got the shaman. Shout out to our boy Sentry. Picking this guy up. Awesome fig. Yeah, let's see, any pops? All right, guys, let's go to the main toy aisle. So coming in thinking we're going to do nothing new, nothing different. There he is, Herman. Herman, Herman, what do you guys think? Look at that, I love it. I really do. It's got the Rob Zombie feel and effect to it. I love that color. It's very Technicolor, very retro. I like it. Definitely something for the shelf. Yeah, it's part of the training team. That's pretty cool. Yeah, this is the other one right there. Yeah. Here's your Bowser. So here. Hey. No, but. So what it is. You could look back here. His little hair, it comes open, and you could put the solution and make it breathe fire. And then Marsha said back here, so there it is. So we had the monster. You got your Ronin. You have your Dreadmon. That's pretty cool. Like Jaguar. And then your. Pizza Squad. This is like the Robocop of the TMNT line. And then here's your Usagi. Usagi? That's awesome. And then your Jaguar. Man Ray. Man Ray. <laughs> Alf. There should be two, yep, two versions of Alf. Look at that. Optimus doesn't belong here. <laughs> There's the... Here, check this out. Spider Gremlin, but no window. Yeah, there's there's reviews out there for him. Let's see, uh, clearance. You got your Grunt and Jersey Red. You got your moves like Jagger. Let's push this to the side. Dirk Savage, and here you go. All you tall thugs and short gangsters. Finally, 
polythons in the house. I'm going to be taking some pictures, sending it to the local peeps. We found it, guys, here in uh, West Ashley. Not too bad. Mona Lisa, that's pretty cool. I like that guy. It has an Ash vibe from Evil Dead. I like these guys too. Oh, that guy looks like the guy from um, Armed and Dangerous with John Candy and Eugene Levy. <laughs> Pretty cool. None of this is my cup of tea, but for you team and tea guys, I could see. I could definitely see it. So I didn't even see back there. I forgot these guys. Mighty Hog and Rhino Man. So that's the complete set. Pretty cool. These guys look really good. Focus. Awesome. Very cool to see. We've seen this here before. The Lightning Collection. I really wish I knew what it looked like. Hey, look at that. Dirt bag. Dirtimus Bagamus. Come on, man. Ugh. Viper Officer. Snake and Timber. Oh, here you go. A little Dino Fury. Yeah. What does this look like? no idea you power rangers peeps let me know we got oh here's the other one space cycle <laughs> there it is yeah we seen this here last week i don't know if we filmed it or not but pretty cool wish we knew what it looked like so you got a little power rangers action uh need dc another viper up here officer viper officer Dead Men, Shazam. Oh, Shazam off the peg. Aquaman, cool label. Let's fix this back up. There's some more over there. Mega Fig with the Mongol. The Fallen. Some Jurassic Park. What'd you think? You like it? Mm -hmm. It's alright. I liked it. Yeah. I liked it. Definitely glad it, we waited to get it on streaming. No new Motu, no new Star Wars. Unless you want to call Lando new. <laughs> Black Series and wrestling. All right, guys. Off to, off to something new and different. West Ashley was good. Rivers was good because our, our buddy Lynn said that they hit a little bit. I don't know if the whole thing. They found monsters there. Herman. Yes or no? No. No? Uh, not over here. Oh. Yes. Man rig. <laughs> okay, well, one. That second smash. Took on Rezar. Neutrinos, Predator, The Bride, some Slash, Ronin, okay. Roboto, Frosta Roboto, Evelyn, some more NECA, let's see, Micro Galaxy Squadron, put it up here. Some retro, retro Luke, and then other stuff, Mecha Neck, Obi-Wan, and AJ No Styles. So Looks the same guys over here. There's some new Power Rangers, some Pokemon Pops, 
Super Mario. There's a princess and some DC McFarlane. Older waves. Here's another uh, Razor Zord next to the Duke and Ram cycle. So let's see. Adam Smasher. And there's the other T Rex Zord. Marvel and Marvel still at 50% off. Let's come down here. Some pops. Luca. <laughs> Luca. Mm -hmm. uh, it's like, that's not Luca. Pops. Oh, big size Pokemon. <laughs> and some NECA we've seen before. So interesting. We saw Man Ray and nothing else. Hmm. There you go, guys. Welcome back for the what's in the trunk portion of this week's video. And man, not a lot of footage like I normally do where I hit 83 million stores and just find anything and everything or nothing new, nothing different. This week, we did find some new things and some great things. Uh, not necessarily for my collection, but I know a lot of you guys are looking for it. Beast Boy is hitting, Gold Label, Walmart exclusive, if I'm not mistaken, and is not the Build-A-Figure, uh, I guess you could say, wave coming from McFarland. So that was awesome to see. And then we did find the Holothon. So yes, the Eminem commercial, they do exist. The TMNT, NECA figures and the Herman Munster and everything for this month's and this, I guess, year's Target haul -a -thon, it actually does exist. So I know I was just kind of playing around a couple of weeks ago saying it doesn't exist, it's fake, it's a big controversy. This, you know, this is all fake. I'm the only one not finding it. Guys, you know, I, you know I was joking. You know I have some thick sarcasm most of the time, so. Um, I'm just glad it finally started to hit our area because I know there's a lot of collectors that are looking for that awesome, awesome TMNT cartoon characters, as well as, you know, some of the other NECA stuff that was put out, you know, uh, for this holothon. Before we get to my actual haul, I just want to make sure I say thank you to everybody who subscribed to the channel, who's watching this video. If you've made it this far, hit that like button. Make sure if you're new to the channel and you want to see what else we could do in JB's Toy Trunk, hit that subscribe button. Ultimately, guys, put the comments down so we can get a crosstalk going. Let me know if you finally found Holothon. Did you pick up anything from Holothon? Are you boycotting NECA? I don't know. Just something. Are you looking for the new Beast Boy? Are you excited for the new McFarlane stuff coming out? There's a lot of heat coming out from Big, the Todd father himself, Todd McFarlane. So uh, let, let's get that dialogue going. Let's get that chat going. Speaking of chat... Those of you guys that attended our live stream just last night, by the time you guys see this, actually be two nights ago. I'm putting this Saturday morning. Hopefully, if the YouTube, if the YouTube gods let me put this on there, um, Thursday night, 7 p.m. Eastern, I got on. Uh, I was invited along with our other friends, Century the Mad Collector, Zach, Jack, Dan, Oleg, Mister Fantastic, and of course the Geek himself, Jersey Geek, on to Man Cave Collectibles. Uh, actual ch YouTube channel. So all six of us got on there and it was a two hour live stream. And, you know, we powerhouse through it, but the, you know, that that's great, man. We were just talking, talking, talking toys. And we actually didn't get to a lot of the subjects we wanted to talk to. And a lot of it was because of you guys. And I say that in a positive way, because you guys interacted in the live chat we got a lot of crosstalk going. We were trying to answer as many questions as possible. So hopefully we did our best to answer your questions and, of course, entertain you guys. And, of course, uh, continue to work this joy of toys and collectibles and this nostalgic thing that we've been doing for I don't know how long, you know, for our pretty much our whole lives. So thank you guys for joining in the live stream. If you were on there, if you had a question or if you didn't get a question answered, Go to the live stream, or you could put it down here, and I'll make sure that if it's not just for me, but for one of the guys that they get it so they can try to get a hold of you. With all that being said, guys, if you missed the actual live stream and you got some time, go check it out. Link will be somewhere 
in the top left of the top right. Uh, go check it out. It's on Man Cave's channel. It was a great time. And thanks again for those of you guys who actually were with us. So let's go ahead and get to this toy haul and really a mail call uh, of this week. I was not really looking for anything in Holothon, and I said I have to kind of see it for himself. I did pick up this version of Herman Munster. I know a lot of people didn't like the movie. I kind of dug it for some reason. I just kind of did. And I'm a I'm a big Munsters fan, and I know there's only one Fred Gwynn, but Car 54, where are you? But sorry for the glare there. I'll I'll take some other pictures to put it on there. But I just I wanted to get it. I wanted to see it in person. I saw it in person. And I think this would be a fun character to add to my shelf. So um I have to definitely if I if I'm keeping Herman, I gotta get grandpa. And then, of course, uh, Lily, Lily Monster there. So there you go. There's a side of it. And I'm probably going to do a review on this. So stay tuned. Let's go ahead and go to what I got from the mail. Let's go to Hasbro Pulse. I've had this on pre-order for a little bit, and it finally came through. I know I have my I'm, – I'm doing a little rearranging there, guys. So I have my Bad Gangsters Cantina down there and. You got the uh, the band over there. I need to reposition them. They've been in that pose for probably three months. I'm pretty sure they're kind of stiff. Um, but that's the, obviously, Black Series size. I also have a cantina over there <laughs> that I wanted to add a band. And there's no other better band to add a smaller scale uh, figure and Dan in the modal nodes. So I did pick this up instead of buying one individually because this pack right here, I haven't opened it yet, should come with the other instruments. So get the whole band, open it up, should be great for some photography and of course just for the display itself. Um, yeah, there you go. One more shipment that we got in the mail and I just got it just now and it's actually two items in there and I am wearing my WrestleMania shirt. Um, I, I went wrestling and Mattel creations kind of finally came through. I'm the last one on earth. I'm kidding. Everybody's been getting theirs except for JB. But if you guys remember that, that W right there, um, previously the WWF world wrestling federation and eventually into WWE world wrestling entertainment, regardless of what it is, these characters in here, bring it back. So here we go. There he is. Oh my gosh. Ravishing Rick Rude in the house. Look at that box. Give me a second. I'm going to go ahead and pull them out. I thought it was going to be two individual boxes, but it's one huge box. Ravishing Rick Rude. You like that? And there he is. Jake the Snake Roberts. Ravishing Rick and Jake the Snake right there. The top. The snake will always bite back. DDT is like life. Cruel. But very cruel. So, uh, I don't think I'm going to do a review on this guy because I'm going to keep him in package for a little bit. But yeah, pretty cool. And then of course for Ravishing Rick Rude, simply Ravishing, keep the noise down. Oh my gosh. Outside of having uh, horrible mustaches, and you know that sarcasm, right? These mustaches are... He's, this is legit. I had to grab this. I had to. So just kind of opening the lid to this big box. Jake the Snake Roberts. Ravishing Rick Rude. Oh my gosh. Kind of... Jake the Snake right there. I'll be taking pictures, guys. Putting these up for you guys. And then there's Ravishing Rick. Look at that dude right there. Always wanted a uh, Rick Rudin because I have a I have a Jake the Snake, but definitely not not on this level. So there you go, Ravishing Rick Rude and Jake the Snake Roberts. So there you go, guys. On the back you got Roberts and Ravishing Rick Rude, Hogan and Terry Funk. I passed on Hogan and Funk. I have these two guys from uh, Mattel Creations and of course Slaughter. What a great week of toy hunting. What a great pickup for me to add to the collection. Thank you guys for always giving us the support. 
tuning into the channels. Always enjoy the ride in life, guys. You guys take care. Have a great and safe weekend. We'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.